Lucinda Lucy May Green, born C. 1975, is a British science communicator and solar researcher. Since 2005, Green has been a Royal Society University Research Fellow, previously the Royal Society Dorothy Hodgkin Fellow at Mullard Space Science Laboratory (MSSL) of the University College London (UCL). Green runs MSSL's Public Engagement Programme and sits on the board of the European Solar Physics Division of the European Physical Society and the advisory board of the Science Museum. In 2013, Green became the first ever female presenter of the Sky at Night following the death of Sir Patrick Moore. She is married to the renowned mathematician, Matt Parker. Green's research focuses primarily on the atmospheric activities of the Sun, particularly particularly coronal mass ejections and the changes in the Sun's magnetic field which triggers them. <laughs> Early life and education Green studied at Dame Alice Harper School in Bedfordshire, gaining nine GCSEs and four A-levels. After completing her A-levels, Green took a year out during which time she studied art, before deciding to pursue physics and completed her undergraduate Master of Physics degree in Physics with Astrophysics at the University of Sussex, graduating with a 2–1. Green completed her PhD in Solar Physics at the MSSL at UCL in 2002. She returns to her old school to discuss her research. Fiona Clements, Green's former physics teacher at the school, has said, she is a great advocate for young women in science and we are proud that she continues to remember the school by returning to talk about her research to pupils. I always liked physics from an early age while I was at school. That was my passion, problem solving or asking questions and then finding out ways of answering those questions but I never had a burning ambition of being a space scientist, and I wasn't even into amateur astronomy at that time. <laughs> Career After gaining her PhD, she moved to Cardiff University's School of Physics and Astronomy and became the project coordinator of the Falks Telescope Project, a project which enables schools to have remote use of two 2-meter class telescopes located in Hawaii, Falks Telescope North in Hawaii, and Australia, Falks Telescope South in Australia. Since 2005, Green has been a Leverhulme Research Fellow, previously the Royal Society Society Dorothy Hodgkin Fellow, at MSSL. Her current work focuses on the pattern of magnetic fields in the Sun's atmosphere, which sporadically erupt to form a coronal mass ejection, how these relate to geomagnetic activity and what this means for those living on the Earth. From 2006 to 2012, she was a member of the Royal Society's Education Committee and was part of their State of the Nation Reports Working Group during 2007 to 2009. She is also member of UCL's Steering Committee for the Beacon for Public Engagement and she runs MSSL's Public Engagement Program. <laughs> <laughs> Solar Orbiter Green is also involved in the development of the Solar Orbiter, a sun-observing satellite under development by the ESA. The aim of the mission is to perform close-up, high-resolution studies of the Sun for a better understanding of the Sun's behavior, heliosphere, solar winds and coronal magnetic field. <laughs> <laughs> Media appearances Green often appears on television and radio most notably The Sky at Night and Stargazing Live, Stardate, Horizon, X-Change and The One Show. 
Her radio programs include, The Infinite Monkey Cage, Saturday Live and PM, BBC Radio 4, Material World, SLU Radio USA, 4 News Hour, BBC World Service, 5 Live Drive and Bacon's Theory BBC 5 Live, The Butcher's Apron and Nick Ferrari LBC. .Between 2004–2005 Greenco presented several programs in the BBC, Open University series, Stardust. Date. Episodes include, Stardate, Mission to Titan which Shiko presented with Adam Hart Davis, covering the European Space Agency successfully landing the Huygens probe on Saturn's largest moon, Titan. And Stardate, Deep Impact which Shiko presented with Brian Cox, covering NASA successfully colliding a probe into the side of Comet Temple 1 in an effort to learn more about the origins of the Solar System. Since 2010, Green has also appeared on and co presented several episodes of Stargazing Live. Green has also appeared on several episodes of the BBC Radio 4 show The Infinite Monkey Cage, discussing topics such as the end of the world and parallel universes. In 2013, Green hosted her own radio program, Solar Max, on BBC Radio 4 on the topic of space weather, specifically addressing how emissions from the sun can cause changes in the Earth's magnetic field and upper atmosphere, and the implications this has for the UK. Topic: <laughs> Personal life. When asked where her love of space science came from, Green has said, "...as a child, I remember hearing my parents say that they thought I was going to be an astrophysicist when I grew up. Not actually knowing what an astro-thinger me what's it was, I agreed with them because I thought it sounded impressive. Really at that time I wanted to look after animals." People used to bring me injured birds and I would stay up all night feeding them worms." Green married stand-up comedian and maths communicator Matt Parker in 2014. The couple used wedding rings made of meteoric iron. <laughs> <laughs> Awards and honors In 2005, Green was a member of a team that won a Royal Television Society's Lifelong Learning and Multimedia Award for a television show covering the transit of Venus, that enabled viewers to make their own Sun Earth distance measurements using observations of the transit that year. Green has won awards honoring her contribution to public engagement with science. In 2009 she was awarded the Royal Society's Cone Award for Excellence in Engaging the Public with Science, for her work engaging a diverse audience with science, and more specifically, for creating a culture of public engagement within her department. In 2017, Green received the inaugural Lees Meitner Medal and Prize of the Institute of Physics. In 2010 she was named one of the UK Top 10 Best Science Educators Under 40 in the Times October Science Supplement, Eureka. In 2015 Green had a bust unveiled at the Royal Society in London, whilst being honoured at an event exploring the history of women and science writing. The bust was created and gifted to the Royal Society by Marcus Cornish. Topic: Publications. Green, Lucy. 2016. 15 million degrees: A journey to the center of the sun. London: Viking. ISBN 9780670922192. OCLC 950951102. Green, Lucy M. 2018. The Origin, Early Evolution and Predictability of Solar Eruptions. Space Science Reviews. Springer. Green, Lucy M. 2009. Flux Rope Formation Preceding Coronal Mass Ejection Onset. The Astrophysical Journal. The American Astronomical Society. 